Hello everyone, welcome to Pumpkin Horror. Now today we're going to be touching base on this big box. I just literally received it about two seconds ago. Pulled it into the house because it's raining outside. And we're going to delve into this box and I'm going to show you what it is. It's a very cool Halloween prop. It is from Halloween 3. It is the singing pumpkin and we're going to get right into that right now. Alright, we're back. We pulled it out of its big bad toy store box. And I'm going to eventually take this apart and see if there's any batteries in it. Uh, according to the last person, he said there was no batteries with this. Uh, but we're going to check it out anyway. Uh, this is from Trick or Treat Studios. It is the actual pumpkin from Halloween 3. Uh, not in the movie. It's not a prop or anything like that. It's just a symbol. When you see it on TV, it actually starts playing the Shamrock song. And it flashes off and on, and that's what this pretty much does. When I seen this, I said, I got to get this thing, because it looks absolutely cool. Now, I will tell you this, I am a fan of Halloween and Michael Myers, but not so much. I'm a bigger fan of other franchises. I do prefer Friday the 13th over Halloween, even though Halloween in itself has better storylines. They're not as cheesy as the uh, Friday the 13th movies. But I like Jason for one reason. He is much more vicious when it comes to killing people. And my all-time favorite uh, franchise is the Hellraiser franchise. They just came out with a brand new movie with a female version of Pinhead. I thought they did that quite well, and I'll be right back. Well, I'm back. And sometimes you get these phone calls. You know they're scammers. And you get the most inconspicuous phone calls. This one was about timeshares that we do not have. But anyway, long story short... It's funny just to listen to some of these uh, phone calls. Alright, getting back on track here. I'm going to go ahead and take this apart. But uh, we're going to look at the box and stuff before I take it apart. And then I'm going to take it apart and see if there's any batteries in it. And see what type of batteries it takes. And I will let you know. So I will go ahead and check out this box here. Let's look at the front of it. Alright, there we go. It's Halloween 3, Musical Light Up, Jolly Jack-O-Lantern. What does that say? Featuring, yeah. Featuring music from the film. Alright, that's what I liked about it. That's what really caught my ear was the actual music. I'm like, holy crap, that's cool. Trick or Treat Studios, guys. All right. Happy, happy Halloween. Just so you get an idea what it is. Alright, what I'm going to do is I'm going to be right back. I'm going to take this thing apart. We're going to look at the pumpkin and then we're going to actually play it. So, we'll be right back. Okay, we are back. And I took it apart and I will tell you this. If you do purchase this, you will need three AAA, not AAA. Uh, I initially put uh, three AAA batteries in it. It didn't work. <laughs> So I put the double A's because it looked like it was a little too small for double A's. Uh, but come to find out they fit perfect and yeah, it works like a charm. So keep that in mind. So you need three double A batteries for this, okay? And it does not come included. But anyway, let's look at the pumpkin and then we're going to go ahead and play the sound effects, okay? Shut that off. Obviously, he is a traditional pumpkin. Now keep in mind, this is not part of the movie. It's... When you actually see it on screen, it is an emblem of a pumpkin, and they obviously play the songs. They just decided to go ahead and create a um, pumpkin in, the, in its likeness, and then turn around and incorporate the music. Which they actually got the copyrights to the song. So that was a good thing. Now this thing here has got little crazy uh, markings in it. Some wounds, or it could be spiders, I'm not sure. You know. But it is a plastic pumpkin, so it's durable for the most part. Now on the bottom of it, obviously you got the switch right here, okay? You unscrew this, put your batteries in, bada bings, bada booms. Okay? Okay. Alright, let's just keep looking at this thing here. Towards the top. Alright, it's all, it's like a traditional pumpkin, that's all it is. But it has that very cool Halloween theme from Halloween 3. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and start the music up for you guys. I 
just keeps repeating is what it does. Okay? It's a very cool Halloween prop for Halloween. I always did like this song. Anyway, don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell if you want to see some more videos. I do have some other stuff coming in, uh, but not right away. But once they do come in, we will do videos on that. In the meantime, you guys have yourselves a good night.